Hey guys, so I'm making this video finally um, and you know using this webcam here to finally gonna return this laptop because ultimately I have nothing running on this laptop right now as you can see um, I'm gonna do an alt tab and you can see perhaps you know the four things the HW info is the only thing running and it says connected to my phone and then snag it really the connected to my phone isn't really even working because I my phone's not connected to the laptop right now in other words there is no connection so it's really two things running and the temperature is about a 65 degree Celsius so 65 C to Fahrenheit and and what this means is it's about 150 Fahrenheit right now and the surface of this laptop is wicked hot and what i am going to show you is let's go to power management and show you the setting that dell uh, customer service which i i give them a lot of credit um i give the customer service a lot of credit for trying to fix the problem um you know i was on the phone with them they were extremely nice and you know they, they acknowledge that this is wicked hot um, and you know, I wish I had a thermal temperature um, measuring device, the wireless temperature me measuring device to measure the temperature, but literally my fingers are on fire right now. Um, I think this is a one-off issue because you know, some of people have commented on my previous videos saying, oh, you know, my benchmark scores are higher, your laptop may not be plugged in and all of that, but that's not the case. This laptop is plugged in right now and um, you know, even when I was doing these other tests. So the thermal management they recommended was cool, okay? And this is under cool and, you know, I have AC blowing in this uh, room and still hovering at 60% with nothing used right now. And, and you know, um, with, a Chrome, with one Chrome browser. Um, and this is just unacceptable for me. Uh, it's wicked hot. Like I can't even rest my hands on on this without you know feeling like I'm gonna burn my my palms or my fingers so that's one of the biggest reasons the other reason is this laptop when I hibernate and try to turn it back on it just jams on the Dell screen for 30 40 seconds and then I have to reset it every single time I do not know what that's about and you know that's definitely been a deterrent for me um, to keep using this laptop. I mean, unfortunately, I can't, you know, afford to spend that kind of money and just not have top of the line performance um, going on right now. So I've called Dell range for shipping. This is my last time using the laptop. I'm going to return it. I'm probably not going to buy this laptop again, at least not until anytime soon. Um, I really enjoyed some of the features. The laptop is fast, but even then, it's not functioning at an optimal level, uh, even from a benchmark perspective, from a heat perspective, from content creation perspective. Um, ultimately, it's not going to work for me. Um, so there you go. Okay. Uh, I'm not sad. Like it, my face may look sad right now, but it was just an experiment that I did trying to consolidate all my desktops for content creation. This, uh, you know, Dell XPS 17 ultimately is not going to cut it right now. So and, and again, you know, for those that may be wondering, the temperature in my guesstimation here outside is also maybe about 150, I don't know, 140, 150 Fahrenheit. It's so hot, so hot. So, um, yeah, unfortunately, I am returning it. All right, peace.